Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. So I've already filmed this video once and I was a bit of a grumpy pants in it. So I'm going to do it again and I'll explain why. So I was super excited. I've been waiting for this. I feel like I'm last one to the party because finally my glossy box has arrived. Um, so yes, I was very, very excited, but just have a closer look and see if there's anything on there that you spot. Have you seen it yet? So I have opened this up. I took my box out. I've seen everyone else's. I've been super excited about the um, this month's box. I've really wanted the Style London box to come. I've taken my box out and this is what I've been faced with. So anyone that's seen the unboxings already will know that this is a bit dodgy because it's meant to be a plain pink box this month and it just doesn't look right does it so as it turns out i have been sent an old box this is february's box from 2018 and um yeah so what i'm going to do i'm going to unbox this show you my products and then i'm going to tell you what's happened and what i've done about it okay so in it is we open it up and whoops and this is how it looks inside here we go i'm calming down oh i've been so angry <laughs> so glossy box 10 pounds a month 325 um postage and packing so it's 13.25 in total got a card which says welcome to valentine's glossy box so yes we're not in february Point number one I'm not going to read you all um but yeah here we go so inside this box I just knew straight away it wasn't right because I know what I'm meant to be getting in it so there is um a skin chemist's 24 hour aqua repair facial serum this is 30 mils and we have got what does it say here? Blah, 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 blah. So suitable for all skin types. The ingredients in this serum work to infuse skin with vitamins and antioxidants to minimize redness and deliver deep hydration. Um, full size would be 64 pounds. Um, and that's what we've got there. Next thing in my February box in November is what have we got here? So this is Studio 10 Makeup Mist Glow Plexion. And this says, um, this mist instantly primes, refreshes and hydrates lackluster skin. It can also be used as a setting spray. And this is travel size is £14. Um, we've got a uh, um, Ciate London um, Nail Polish. And this mini size is £6. Say hello to this month's Discovery brand Ciate, um, based in London and loved by Beyonce, Adele and Kylie Jenner, to name but a few. This fearless brand is renowned for its huge range of colours and um, powerful creativity, but most importantly, we love Ciate's no-nonsense approach to animal cruelty. Your Ciate nail varnish is Peter certified and vegan friendly with a gel finish. Ciate polishes allow flexibility to minimise chipping and provide up to 10 days high gloss shine. Um, next thing we've got is Steve Laurent and this is a nude pop lip tint and it says this gorgeous creamy lip tint is cruelty free, hydrating and long lasting. Full size is £17 and it is, looks like quite a nice shade actually. Um, so this is the pot, it looks really lovely and inside... It looks sort of quite a nice sort of nude shade, creamy texture. And that's nice. It's quite um quite neutral and nude and it feels nice, doesn't feel sticky. So that is a nice product. Um and then finally there is a sleek eye divine storm palette. Um this is a full size um RRP for $8.99. Take your look from natural to dramatic with these 12 super pigmented shades in this palette. Um, so I'll open this and have a look. 
So what I'm going to do on the back end of this video, I'll tag my original video of when I opened it for the first time so you can see how grumpy I am. Um, yeah. So it's just your traditional sort of matte black with your gloss um, writing. These are quite nice palettes. The sleek palettes aren't bad, you know. Um, here are oh, all mostly shimmers. I think it looks like three mattes. But um, there we go. So they look quite nice. Quite like this sort of shade and this one. Quite look. These look. They look quite a nice sort of variety of colours, really. Um, not sure they all go together too much, but you'll be able to create a few looks out of that. Um, now, what's narked me a bit about this box? So not only is it not the right box, but also there are products missing out of it. So how cheeky they send you an old box and only half a box. So missing in this box. So yeah, you meant to get the nail polish, which we did. Um, then it says about the lip tint, which we got. And then it is the glow plexion, which we got. Um, the facial serum, which we got. But then we should have had um, a mascara, um, which was a full size, which was RRP at £15. So we've, we've not got that. That's missing. Um, sleep makeup palette we got. And then it says um, there's meant to be an I Love Contour. Um, so blah, 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 blah. the lightweight eye contour cream work to hydrate shrink blood vessels and that so that's missing which is here so that's missing out of it and that um full size meant to be um 30 pounds 99 um and it was actually a full size product so that's a big chunk out of your box and then there was a rodile um glamour lash mascara xxl which was also missing so it's missing two mascaras plus that eye contour cream so that's a lot to miss out of your monthly box so um yes yeah, so i've rang them and i asked where my november box was they said that they haven't had enough boxes to send out and they've run out so my argument was that as um as a subscriber you know i should be guaranteed a box it's my expectation that if i subscribe to a service they provide me with that service um she says I think it's probably been a bit of a problem this month I'm aware that if you take out a new subscription you may always not get that month's box and it does state that on the website however at no point have I been notified and if I was I would have cancelled my subscription I don't want all half boxes so they are going to source the products for me and they're going to send them out and I should receive that in about seven to ten days hopefully and um, if I haven't heard anything within the week I'm going to give them a call back um, they were quite apologetic um, and apologies are great, apologies are fine. Um, let's just see if their actions match their promises and I just feel like I've been really let down this month with my beauty boxes. So obviously I've waited a long time for this spawn, it's come, it's wrong. I still haven't got my birch box and yeah, it's just really annoying me. I just feel it's just not good enough, you know, and it's, it's the 13th, 13th? 13th of November and um, yeah everything I'm, by the time I get it it's no good I have told her that I'm a YouTuber and I do unboxings and I kind of like have an expectation to have my things early in the month so I can share them with you guys and it benefits them because we sort of generate people towards their site as well and people can see and think oh that looks a nice box I think I'll purchase it so this is a negative experience for me at the moment and I'm going to share that with you because I'm honest and if I, if I love something, I'll let you know. If I'm disappointed, I'll let you know. And I am really disappointed. But as long as they keep good to their word and deliver me my box, then that is great. But, yeah. So I hope you've enjoyed this. I hope it's not been too negative. Bit of a surprise. Um, so, yeah, do leave me a comment. Let me know, has this been happening to you before? Because that's just like... I just haven't heard of it, you know. So... Has this happened to you? Let me know what's happening. If they've let you know, if they've sort of given you something else. To be fair, they have said I can keep the products that have been sent out already as a goodwill gesture. So that's very, very good. Um, if you're interested in watching my first unboxing of this box and my reaction as I did sort of realise what had happened, carry on watching. If not, I'll see you next time. Bye, guys. 
Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Um, tonight I have an unboxing for you and finally it is ooh, <laughs> my glossy box. So I've been sat waiting for this to arrive. I can't wait to get inside it. I've seen everyone else do their unboxings and mine's just been so slow at arriving. So glossy box, multi subscription, £10 plus £3.25 postage and packaging. I've got a link down below if you um, want to save, I think it's 20% off your first box, but there's a referral link down below anyway. Have a little look there, it will let you know. Um, and so yeah glossy box at last i'm still waiting on my birch box to come i am so peeved i really am but um yeah it'll be here soon but it's now nearly the middle of the month i've emailed them they've ignored me and it was only just dispatched yesterday i think which is just shocking anyway here we go so into my glossy box we go i'm home from work i've had my dinner i'm in my jammers my cozy ones so you just have to Excuse me. <laughs> so, here, oh, ooh, what's, hey, what's this? Everyone else has had the plain box. What's going on? Now, I am a subscriber. I had, this had better be this month's box because if it isn't, I'm going to be absolutely fuming. Um, I've been subscribed for a while and I have seen that they've sold out of their boxes, but I am expecting as a subscriber to have the proper box. This looks like an old box. Um, here we go. And um, what have we got here? Um, right, I'm fuming. So this box is for... What month is this? Does it tell me on here? Last February's box. This is Valentine's Day edition. Right, I am going to be emailing them and trying to sort this out because this is really unacceptable. So, I was wanting um, the Style London palette. So, Glossy, if you're watching, really, this is very, very bad. Anyway, let's see what we've got inside. It is a Valentine's Day box. And I'm absolutely... Oh, I'm so angry. Right, so what have we got? I've actually got some of the things in here already, so I really... I'm not going to open it. I'm probably going to send it back to them. Um, let's see what we've got. So we've got um, the Skin Chemist um, Aqua Repair Facial Serum. And I am actually using this currently, I do believe, which I can show you. I also have one. Um, which is the same as this. So there we go. I've already got one. Um, there's no point giving you the details, but I will... Um, so it's suitable for all skin types and um, the ingredients in this serum work to infuse the skin with vitamins and antioxidants to minimize redness and deliver deep hydration um, full size should be 64 pounds that's item number one. Oh, why does this keep happening to me next thing is a Steve Laurent lip gloss let's have a little look um, so it's nice packaging it does look pretty, but it's in a pot, so you need to have um, either use your finger or a brush. And this says, um, Gorgeous creamy lip tint is cruelty free, hydrating and long lasting. Full size, £17. I'm really upset. Next thing is a Studio 10 Makeup Mist Glow Plexion, which is this. So there's extra lighting on now. For some reason, my computer, which is behind my iPad, has just sprung into life. Um, this says... Um, ba -dum -ba -dum -ba -dum -ba -dum. Makeup Mist Glow Plexion. This mist instantly primes, refreshes and hydrates lacklustre skin. It can also be used as a setting spray. This is a travel size worth £14. Next item is a Ciate um, Mini nail polish and this says where are we oh and so this isn't even on this this is a filler because it's not even on the card so there we go so they haven't even given me this box um and then we've got a sleek palette 
which is in, it says I Divine Storm. As I say, I'm not opening it because I'm probably going to send this all back. Um, so a full-size palette worth $8.99. So, considering they've tried to give me a pass box, it's not even a complete pass box. So there are items missing. So I've got the palette, the Glow Mist thing, um, the um, serum and the lipstick. So missing out of this, um, there should also be uh, mascara. There should be um, a contour cream. And there should also be another mascara, which is a bit bizarre. So as you can see here, I have not got all my items. I'm missing this, this, and this. So I think this is absolutely shocking. I don't think this should be happening. I'm going to get on to customer services. I will give you an update. And I'm absolutely fuming. So... I'm moaning again, but there we go. It's just not right. And when it's not right, it's not right. So I'm going to go. I'll catch you all later. Um, take care and I'll see you next time. Bye.